All right, Lawrence, do your thing now. We got Lawrence here helping me. Kind of unbolt it. Tank right here. And up here. So go ahead, Lawrence, pull the tank off. Well, we already drained the gas too, so. There shouldn't really be much gas in there. I mean, without breaking it, Lawrence. <laughs> Looking a little rough there. There's gonna be some wires. Let's like don't pull my wires. You got it? I'm thinking. You might have to buy a tool to unbolt it. Oh, let me see. So I think this is what. What is this too? It's just your uh, breather. This is it right here. So your bike is fuel injected. That's the good stuff. All right. You're gonna have to look how to take that off, dog. Ah, Lawrence doesn't know what he's doing. Nope. We gotta, you know. My dirt bike was easy. It was just a plastic clip that you would pull and freaking pull it off. All right. <laughs> Give us a minute. We figure this out. All right. So we got the tank off. It wasn't too difficult. We just kind of pulled this out, and then this was kind of the issue, but it really wasn't that hard. I guess the um, little part that connects to the tank, you just push it up, pull it out. And then the wiring, which is, oh, still on the tank. Over here. Hey, is there any gas in here? You should check. There isn't, there would have been leaking out. I think there might be a little bit. Well, it isn't leaking out because and then, it's, uh, it's all like mechanical in there. So oh, you have a fill pump, you know? Yeah, yeah. So there's that wire. We just had to find the end, just unplug that. So now we just got to pretty much sand it down. Primer it, and then do his body work a little bit, brother. Yeah, finish the body work. Still low right there and high, high. So I haven't finished. To finish, take it home, finish it for me. This one don't feel that. This one, watch. This is the hard part right here. Look, you guys, we we'll be so struggling right here. right here. This is the struggles right here. We're gonna come to the corner. Fill that, Lawrence, right here. All right, dog. Fill Let's the see. corner. Okay. All right, he going home. He's out. He's going home. See you later, YouTube. He hates us. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so now we just gotta get this off, which I don't have the tools. Alright, for sure. So, we'll probably continue another day. I'm gonna actually buy the tools to get this off. Alright, so here's Michael. He's trying to take the steering wheel off. This is our, our plans today, basically. You know? Maybe uh, an 11. He's a professional here. He actually works at a, lock, a locksmith shop. So he should know what he's doing because if he does, then I gotta do it. Then I'm gonna talk to his boss. You know that's gonna. Knock I'm gonna right tell him to hire me instead. <laughs> and then we got Martino over there, you know, just chilling, not doing his job. Yeah. Worst water boy ever. <laughs> All right, so we got the steering wheel back on, but the car still doesn't start. That one don't work <laughs> So, but we're done with this. The homie over here is gonna go make some more keys so we can have some spares. And then Martin's gonna hopefully go get this thing fixed now that we got the, the connection done. So we're back, another day, Lawrence came to help me. As you can see, Lawrence is cheap. He didn't want to buy a jack. So we had to jack it up with a regular jack. Right here. And we just put on some, some bricks I found in the yard. 
Only problem was when we jacked it up, we jacked it up from the... What is that, a sway bar? Not a sway bar, right? A-arm. Yeah, I guess the A-arm, whatever, for the bike in the back, or the tire in the back. And, um, I guess while we were jacking it up to get the, the bricks under, it got stuck, so kind of tried to kick the tire down. We got it down. And then just pulled everything out, so now we just gotta just take out these wires. Yeah, you know. And we'll have the fender off. So, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. Now that we got pretty much the whole bike taken apart. And now we're just gonna, I guess, sand it down. So in the next video, we'll probably just paint it. Hopefully by then. And you guys can see, cause we just gotta just do the tank and the fender.